I we are from Z College of Engineering and Technology, and we are. Yeah. Hi, hi, hi. Continue, please. <laughs> Your name, please. Uh, my name is Kirill. Uh, my name is Veronica. You are from Russia. Uh, are you excited for attending the Tech Summit? Yeah, really. We are really excited. Uh, we uh, uh, we hear more about uh, Bangalore Tech uh, Summit, and uh, we are so excited of uh, this event. Uh, yeah, we uh, try to build a uh, productive and efficient communication. Yeah, and of course to present our platforms, their unity. Yeah. What's your purpose for here, Bangalore Summit? We would like to find uh, new potential technology startups in India, and we want to help them to scale to Russian market, for example, or to bring Russian startups to India. And also, we are interested to help Indian startups find um, new, not new, but uh, investments money, money from uh, investors, international and Russian also. Nice, yeah. nice, nice of you. And here, our college is representing four projects. So, would you like to see your yes, look on it? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. I'm studying in Panel Engineering, CS. And this is my application. Uh, I'll show you the demonstration first, then I'll deal with the technicality or the doubts. Is it fine? Yes. So, this is yeah. the application. This is Power Permit. It's a, the objective of this application is to protect the safety of uh, human beings. When you are in the uh, crime prone areas or the red alert areas or areas where you are. Uh, prone to criminal offenses, then we can use the application. Right. And uh, this is an Android application, so we can't work on laptop with this. It is a Windows version, right? Windows and iOS won't uh, support the application. I'll show you the demonstration on my uh, uh, lab Android device itself. And this is the application. So, the, the application basically what it does is, it has four options for the users. This is the user interface. All I have to, now I have this application, but I'm shaking the application, nothing is happening. It doesn't work until I want it to operate. So, when I want it to operate, when I'm uh, uh, scared of having any mis, uh, inform mis things or like uh, mistakes or with me or some kind of crime, all I need to do is I have to start the SMS alerts. All that is done. And uh, for you to show demonstration, I want any one of your number to be saved over here. Can I have any of your numbers, please? You have take my number. 63 62 62 87 87 89 89 Check if it is right. Yeah. Okay. As you saw, I have sh saved our number right now. Okay. And also that uh, I have started the SMS alerts. Those two things are need to be done. After that, when I'm feeling unsafe, uh, even my data is off, Wi Fi is off, and my GPS is off. All three are in the off condition, more like an aeroplane. And I'm locking my phone. It's not switch off. I'm just locking the phone. And then when I'm uh, walking, there's a frequency of shake movements. So that uh, I'll uh, adjust the volume so that people won't get disturbed. Just a second. I have set it to medium so that uh, it won't cause yeah. any disturbance. Even now, all three are in off condition and I'm locking the phone. Uh, for walking frequency, nothing will happen. I'm moving the phone. But when somebody is attacking me and I'm vigorously shaking my phone like this, you will have an alarm message. Uh, you can listen to it uh, from nearby. Uh, okay. Uh, if it I, if I set it to high, it will be more. Uh, it will go even more. And uh, where number I have saved, then get a message with my live location. You can tap oh. on the link. Tap the link. Okay. The location is accurate to one meter. So right now, wherever the phone is, until there, the location will be. And as you know that it is not uh, taking support of any of the IT protocols, any of the internet or the Wi-Fi services. So even if the attacker takes out my uh, SIM card, it doesn't affect any uh, programming of the or working of the application. Until and unless my phone is uh, completely uh, distracted and uh, completely crashed to the battery core level, it will be working fine. So you will get the live location uh, at an instant of every 5 minutes until and unless it is completely crashed. This is for open environment where you can get uh, uh, people's attention due to the volume. But there are situations when we are in a closed environment like cars, tunnels. At that particular instance, uh, the sound can be a third one for us. So that if the sound is smooth, the, attacker, the first thing we will be doing is we will uh, completely destroy my phone. 
So at that kind of situation, I can alter the volume. I can keep it to zero, and then I'll start the application. So he won't be aware of any volume. But even though the messages will be sent to the mobile number from this number itself, and they'll be getting my live location. Uh, there are systems existing in the market, the Apple or the Play Store. The only difference is I am not using any of the internet services because in far forest areas and the areas where I can't get data or the Wi-Fi connection or GPS connection, at that time if it is not working, then it is of not uh, that much use. It is not of use at that uh, particular conditions. So we are using the Android system services, Android location services, the coordinate service if we have in system settings, and the SMS service. Uh, and one more advantage is if I am using internet for messaging, there are illegal ways that I can. If I am an attacker and I know a little bit of technology, I can delete that message in the receiver phone also. But using the system message services, SMS service, no matter what I do, even in illegal ways, the message won't be deleted in the receiver's phone. So that's another advantage which it has over the existing system. So that's the application about. Any doubt? Any logical uh, misconclusions? Uh, looks very exciting. Uh, I suppose uh, that is a very uh, useful uh, app. So, uh, do you have a, a business card or something like that about your project? Because uh, business business card. Uh, no, I don't personally own any uh, visiting card. But as a part of college, I have this college brochure. Okay. If you want to contact uh, talents like this or any other talents, we have so many projects. The objective of us uh, demonstrating this project is that we want to uh, let the people know the dimensions of the companies, the organization that coming here, so that the talents like this and the project much more like this is a micro level project. Are working in our college, and uh, if mutually both are agreeing on that particular project, if they like the idea, and if they want the founder to invest, so that uh, it will mutually benefit both the organization as well as the developer. So that's the objective of us being here. So this is our college brochure. You can uh, visit the college for more such projects, or if you want to have any workshop or the hiring or any of sort things. You can visit the college premises. Okay, great. And uh, where where we can find the uh, closest uh, contact here? Uh, you have the management contact here. If you want the placement related or the project related contact, you have uh, you can have any one of num our number. So the you want our number? What what are your next steps with this uh, uh, project? We are deploying uh, on the Play Store. I want one more thing to be done that I am currently working on. What is that thing? Is uh, But all the thing, one drawback is that if the circle contacts wherever I'm saving on that uh, particular APK, if they are not handling their device well, if the device is uh, lost or something is happening with their device, they are not working. If the device is not in working condition, their device, the receiver. At that time, uh, we can have this message sent to servers of cyber police or the criminal uh, police uh, networks, not the infrastructure. But the networks are deployed at every 500 or 600 meter radius. Uh, it's a legal thing in India, so that uh, every 600 meters we have cyber network. I want that message to be sent to that particular 500 radius uh, server, so that even if my network, the circle, the private circle of mine, if it is, if they are not seeing the message, if they are ignoring or some sort of issue they are dealing with with their device, that uh, server, whatever the cyber server, they will be interacting with the victim. Okay, please take care. Great, thank you so much. It was an exciting. Yeah, uh, thank you so much for your time. Thank you. But we will contact you.